Hi guys, um, this is just a quick demo as usual of um, something that I knocked up last night, which is that there. It's basically uh, like a, a dying battery voltage reducer. 20 pedals, dead simple to knock up. Um, but if anybody wants to know how to do it or wants me to knock them one up, send me a message and I'll get it sorted for you. Um, Really easy, like I say, and there's plenty of information out there on the webs to uh, show you what to do. But basically, it won't work with any digital pedals or anything like that, it only works with analog pedals. Um, so, I've got a rat, and this is um, basically a tube screamer, a uh, home built tube screamer. Um, so, yeah, down straight on in. Uh, guitar is a vintage strap copy. Um, <laughs> straight into an orange tiny terror so just to show you that everything's uh, stock you know all normal stuff nothing modified or anything like that um, it's clean tone this is the wrapped straight off the bat that's the wrap this is the tube screamer Basically, what this does when it's in, um, I'll tell you how to connect it up, it goes straight from, well, you can see, you probably can't up here, um, just off the screen up here. Uh, you take a daisy chain power supply, power supply goes straight into that, and daisy chain out to the rat and the tube screamer, and then you just connect to your pedals like you normally would. Uh, all it does is it reduces the voltage to the circuit, and like years ago people used to put dead batteries and things like that in pedals to make them sound a bit weirder. Um, this is a warning straight away, this is not for tone freaks or anybody who's precious about the tone because you get weird trails and squelching noises and stuff like that. I'm just going to uh, have a quick do with this now just to show a few people who've been asking me about it what it does. Um, but it's very um, interactive with different pedals so you'll see in a minute that where this starts to break up, this one doesn't. Um, it can go a bit further than this one So, and I've tried it with a big muff and a couple of other pedals so it is different with different pedals. Um, so as that's set now, it's just on normal voltage. Uh, it goes all the way around to basically cutting the supply off. Um, so if we start normal voltage, we'll bring the rat back in. Yeah. You see it cuts off and then you'll start getting squelching noises and things like that. You need to compensate with a bit more volume. That's why I like the sort of stuttery, spluttering effects like that. So all that happens if you push it too far is it'll cut power off. Bring it back in slowly. So yeah, that's the wrap. Um, 
Troop Screamer. It's pretty much about normal just there. It starts to kick in when you put it around to about 12 o'clock. So again, just compensate with a bit of volume. So yeah, that's about it really. I mean, it's not something that you'd probably use uh, live in a band or anything like that, but messing around in your bedroom, it's a, it's a bit of a laugh trying to get new sounds out of older pedals. See so if anybody wants an info or anything like that, give me a shout. Uh, that's about it. Cheers.